comes to your presence, when it comes to your spirit, when it comes to your voice, and I'm learning to listen, just to rest in your nearness, I'm starting to Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Whitey Aroi and Ichan Mokoni, an imperfect girl trying to seek perfection in the eyes of God. I create content around faith, beauty and lifestyle. If that screams you, if that is something that you also relate to, please be sure to click on that subscribe button and also on that notification bell so that you don't miss a thing and become part of this online community. If you are new here, I'd like to say welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, you already know I love you. Kaleratola love. Thank you guys for the support. We are currently sitting on 500 subscribers. I'm grateful. Uh, especially because I haven't been posting in a while. Life has been lifing. You are definitely going to find out why I was off. And yeah, let's get into this video. I hope you guys enjoy. It's been a while. Life has been lifing. I haven't been in the streets for a long time now. And that is because I've been using. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> 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 the phone is a SIM card. So I've been using the SIM card. So that's why baby girl has been on the low. And I said life has been lifing. I went, also went on a fast. So that was like, yeah. It was very refreshing. You know, it was very good to do it off, off the socials. Guys, I'm just here from God with no distractions and all of that. I lost some few kilos. I'm really grateful. Today is a Saturday. And I'd like to take you guys with me. I'm about to go outfit hunting because I am serving tomorrow and the theme for tomorrow is sky blue no baby blue and navy blue funny enough blue is my is my favorite color I hope I get what I'm looking for something that I'll be comfortable with you know not just something that is wearable something that is my style this will be a vlog I'll be taking you guys with me I'm just waiting for my sister and then we'll hit the road yeah. I'll tell you all about my life outside the social media <laughs> I'm still struggling to get an outfit that I'm comfortable with. I got a dress, but it's like short sleeve and it's cold. So now we're going to Chinatown. Hopefully I get something. I really prefer wearing a skirt over a dress. If it's a dress, it has to be long sleeve. If it's short sleeve, then it becomes a problem because now I must get something to cover up. And the design of this dress doesn't want any covering so pray for me But the 
so we can clean it install here and yeah rehearse 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 I'm so exhausted guys okay I just got home now and I'm about to show you guys my outfits I have two fits that I got one is a dress the other one is a two-piece so you guys are gonna help me pick no actually so you guys will let me know in the comments if you think I made the right decision you probably you probably see uh, the outfit that I chose tomorrow this is the first dress that I've got there guys I hate it but this was the first thing that I could get when I went to the shops so I was like you know what let me take this because I'm not sure if I will win in the other shops so let's try this on and see it's in the size medium I honestly don't like it what do you think it's, it feels like grown <laughs> it's grown woman it's giving <laughs> Ma'am, it's giving grown. It's giving ma'am actually. It's giving ma'am. It's giving ma'am. Um, so if I was wearing this, I'd definitely pair it up with some black shoes. And yeah, my problem is it's short sleeve, and it's not a kind of dress where you'd want to cover up. So it's winter, baby. It's winter season. We cannot risk it, and it's very cold. So, this is the first dress. Let me know what you guys think. But I feel like those blue and those shoes. It's a long vlog, you Happy Sunday guys I hope you're good I hope you're strong And I hope you're blessed Today I'd like us to speak about serving And what that means to me you know, I used to think that people who are called to serve are people who have perfected talents and abilities that are best suiting for their calling. But I got to learn and understand that perhaps we are called to develop specific talents and attributes in whatever department we are called to serve in. The Lord knows us and He doesn't call the qualified, but He qualifies those that answer to the call willingly because he is a gentle god and he will never force himself on us he'll never force us to serve him he said in his word that if we can't do it he'll raise stones to serve him because he can do that so our good god knows exactly which callings or opportunities will help us grow and mature in our spiritual lives in the book of luke 2 verse 40 we read about a child that grows into a savior in his adulthood and the verse says that the child grew and increased strong in spirit filled with wisdom and the grace of God was upon him which then shows us that through the grace of God our life experiences willingness efforts and obedience to him we also gain spiritual maturity and increase strongly in our faith 
And when we are rooted in his presence, we also gain great wisdom that can only be obtained through Christ. You know, I'm not even gonna lie. For me, the call to serve came with the feeling of fear, peace, and spiritual growth. My biggest reason to serve God was because I wanted a deeper relationship with him. You know, I wanted to challenge myself with something that will eventually help me grow in my spirit. But child, the spirit of fear really had me on chokehold. One thing about the spirit of fear is that it can paralyze us if we allow it. You know, Usatane brings us the spirit of fear so that he can have power over us. So it's always in his plans to confuse and discourage us from doing what the Heavenly Father has already deposited in our lives. Usatan we as good is petting the goal. And you mang have a little sabi and pulinze to Natis ya saba as a konui and salenti and cool pagati wait. I might not be the greatest singer in this world, but I know that God has called me to this ministry and I will serve him with all that I have and he will qualify me because I said yes to his call. Say hi to my people. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> Are you making your way to go to church? Stay you better, you better, you better. Stay you better. better. <laughs> I'm vlogging. Today is a Sunday and today I was serving in the worship team ministry. I'm just so grateful. Like the way he ministered to me and through me, it's, yeah, it was amazing. This entire week, there was a song that was burning in my heart, a song that I was listening to. And the song was saying that God, whenever I stand to speak, May people not see me, but may they see you in me. Whenever I stand to sing, may people not see me, but may they see you in me, you know? And it goes on to say that, God, check my motive, like, help me to die more and more of myself. And that has been my prayer to say that whenever I'm giving it a chance or time to serve you, May it not be me who stands in front of your people. May people see the God in me. And I'm just so grateful 
because God really ministered through us today. It was not us standing in front of the people and and singing to the people, but it was the spirit man inside. And, you know, it's in line with the word that was shared today. The word today was speaking about leaving your inside out, like leaving inside out. Basically speaking about the importance of feeding your spirit man so that it can be it can bring fruits. And they were just speaking about, you know, how when your inside is unhealthy, it starts to spill over your physical. Mm. That's a word for someone. I don't know about you, but that was a word for me. And I was just thinking to myself in the morning, like I was so stressed when I was busy Ubering to go to church. And that moment almost hindered me from receiving from God. Also the frustration that I had, you know, and when I got there, I was like, God, help me to die to myself help me not to allow my emotions my frustrations to be the ones that are going to stand on the stage and minister to you like just cleanse me this morning so that when i stand to worship it's not me that they hear but it's you oh god it's the spirit in me inside so that is very important to guard your heart to be mindful of your emotions and just die to self and make sure that when you serve God, you serve God in spirit and in truth. Serve God not with a heavy heart. Serve God with a happy heart so that you don't hinder yourself from not receiving or hearing from him. Yo, I was, I was like, oh my God. Like I was so stressed in the morning. Like, ah, I wanted to scream. <laughs> like the ubers were cancelling left right and center and i was like oh my goodness i'm definitely gonna be late you know this is not good like one thing i hate is being late for church church starts at half past nine and i was supposed to be there at half past seven i'm busy requesting from seven there are no ubers there's no transport and i'm just like oh my god this is so frustrating like i'm definitely gonna be late and i only got transport at like half past seven when I'm supposed to be at church on the way I was so stressed I was so frustrated and I was just praying in the car to say that God may I not allow what I'm feeling right now to hold me to hold me captive may I not allow my feelings to hold me captive so that I'm unable to worship you in spirit and in truth cleanse me right now hold me oh God like take this heavy heart like mend it mend this heavy heart and just make me forget about everything and the moment i stepped into the church the moment i stepped in like just seeing the people being received well you know people in good spirits and i was just like god thank you and i was like thank you god thank you god because i literally forgot about the hectic morning that i had at the moment i stepped in there you know i was not frustrated like funny enough i just switched like this like i forgot i forgot that i was even late like i forgot that my emotions were were all over the place god just brought me back like we here now we here let's focus on this and i'm just so grateful like god is amazing god is good and i will leave to serve him i will leave to worship him you know what i can't stress this enough guys like always die to yourself the devil can use the smallest things to distract you and in that moment just like that you miss from god mm, <laughs> we're getting some 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 <laughs> Every man for himself. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I'm going to stay at it. Lord, I know my heart wants more. My heart wants something new. And we have come to the end of this video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for your support. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave your comments down below and stay blessed. Thank you.